Okay, uh, John, yeah. so um, uh, could you please introduce yourself? Uh, my name is John Blakey Selolwane from Botswana and I play guitar and sing and produce. And now you have been in Sweden. Uh, could you tell me what has been happening here? Uh, we, 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 I came in Sweden this year because of Shanti Law. And they asked me, he asked me, him and his manager asked me if I could accompany them. And I said, no problem. Uh, to come and do the festival, the Pride, Stockholm Pride Festival. That's why I'm here. And how has it been, uh, this journey for you? This journey has been very enlightening in terms of, I've been coming to Sweden since 1982, but this has been the longest time I've been in Stockholm for two weeks. And um, I've learned a lot about the Swedes, the warmth that they have. And boy, it's just, <laughs> I remember the other day I was saying, saying to an audience, uh, if I had my way, if wishes were horses, I would adopt probably about 10 ships of Swedish people to take them home and be with them in Botswana. That's wonderful. And uh, what the difference uh, do you think that this, has tri this trip has made for people in Sweden to get to know Botswana? Uh, I think, I think it, it, by coming in, we sort of drew attention uh, to a lot of Swedes, uh, Swedish people who didn't, who didn't know about the existence of Botswana, or they know about the existence of Botswana, but they didn't know about the talent, that Botswana too has a talent, just like any other country. And um, we've been well received in terms of, I mean, right now, I'm, I'm, I'm in seventh heaven. That's very good. And uh, musical-wise, do you think that uh, this is going to take you further? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. As long as we are going to keep up the, uh, that close relationship, the friendship of Swedish and Botswana people. I mean, anything that is little that we do out here will go for, you know, will go for miles, if you know what I mean. Because that's the only way we can, um, uh, be, especially for the young generation, if they come to Sweden here, that's a first step to international recognition. Because in Sweden you have some of the sweetest and best musicians that I've come across. And I've played with a few of them. They just, something else. So this trip has given you hope for the future then? Yes, definitely, definitely, definitely. We hope we'll be back as soon as possible. You're I mean, welcome. It will be nice. <laughs> you know what I mean? It will be nice like, whoops, right back in Sweden. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And then um, I can continue uh, because I love languages. And the Swedish language is one language that I miss. But I would love to learn it, to speak it. Then I teach you something. Tak så mycket. Tak så mycket. Yeah. That's thank you very much. Yeah. Oh, so there you, you are. So Swedish. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Swedish is like, oof. It's home, away from home. I love it. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>